say we're young and we don't know Won't find out until we grow Well, I don't know if all that's true Cause you got me and baby, I got you Babe, I got you, babe I got you, babe I got you, babe they say our love won't pay the rent Before it's said our money's all been spent I guess that's so, we don't have a pot But at least I'm sure of all the things we got Babe, I got you babe I got you babe I got you Hello, welcome to Anarchy in the Ukulele with me, Abby the Goldberg, and you, K the D. Welcome, campers. Have we got news for you? Competition time. Competition time. I feel like we should have some sort of jingle. Oh. Oh. Has Bongo Boy well, got a jingle? That's just the bit of music we constantly oh, well. play, isn't it? It'll do. Um, yeah, so if you watched our live, you would have seen this. But if you didn't, this is the video for you. Because this is our biggest competition ever for this Martin T1 Streetmaster tenor, tenor ukulele. Ukulele. Look at it. Mm, it's beautiful, isn't it? It is a beauty. Bongo Boy is right on that shot. Look. Wow. And I keep moving it when he gets it in focus <laughs> and like. Um, it is a beauty. It is, um, it is a relic. Mm, you love a relic I ukulele. I don't do you? love it. Um, you know, it's it's done pretty naturally, but I just really like it because it feels like it has been played in, and you know, you get that kind of feels like it's got a history. Yeah, well, with new instruments, you quite often you have to play them in for kind of a few weeks or even months before they kind of feel natural. This one felt natural straight away. Should we do the specs? Let's. Should we tell the lovely people the specs for this instrument in our competition? Yeah, I'm, I'm too excited today. I, know. I, can't, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm so this excited. This bad boy retails for 535 English pounds. Currently, it's gone up because it was 400 and something. So you know, it's it, only getting it's only better. getting more expensive. Oh. It is a solid mahogany body. It is solid mahogany top. Back and sides. It's got a Murado bridge. Has it? Apparently so. Murado bridge. Uh, and it has got a compensated tusk saddle. Yeah, so nicely compensated. Um, good saddle. Same with the nut. The nut is tusk as well. Um, it's a 40 millimetre. No, it's not. I knew you'd get that wrong. You didn't read it properly, did you? The spacing at the saddle spacing is 40 millimetres. Spacing at the saddle is 40, meters, is 40 millimetres. Oh. So from there to there is 40 millimetres. Spacing at the top is 34 mil. Ah, oh, very interesting. Um, I believe. That's not on our screen at the minute. But, um, which is really, it's quite narrow. But there's something about this instrument that it doesn't feel narrow to me. So... I play this all the time. This is my Martin. We're actually giving you a brand new one. <laughs> Kevin won't give it up. <laughs> I won't give it. No, I won't give this one up. Um, and normally on the other instruments, the flights that we've got and the new and new and newy, they're quite wide nuts, at least 38 mil. This is only 34. But this is the one I use all the time and it doesn't feel small. So I'd say don't let that put you off. This free £500 ukulele. Well, yeah, but you might not win it and you might want to go and buy one because they're so uh, good. Yeah. We don't, we're not working for Martin here, by the no. way. Martin have not sponsored this video. Um, this is coming out of our own pockets. It is, because we're that nice. Yeah. Uh, it's got an, an aged satin finish. Yep. Which is nice. So it's, it's not nice. super shiny. It's been basically, it's been rubbed down before it's had this kind of dragged satin the car varnish. Park. It's not been dragged through the car park. There's no dings in it. It's just kind of been rubbed down in places. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> You're with us. <laughs> I'm with you. I was just going to talk about the tuners, but the I didn't know. The Graph Tech Ratio tuners. Yes. Um, so these on the back. I really like these. They're really good tuners. It says Tuna Laylee on the screen. Tuna Laylee. 
Has Sam been typing things on here? <laughs> I was I, like, what's a tuna lady tuna? I think he's been, um, I think Bongo <laughs> Boy has been editing our auto cue. Um, so, yeah, Graph Tech tuners, really nice. I like they them. They look lovely. I think some people don't like the black, but I think they look great. And it holds its tune really well, doesn't it? Yeah, it certainly does. Um, it weighs 575 grams. And its country of origin is Mexico. Mexico! Yay! Like your dog. Like my dog, I've got a chihuahua. Um, yeah, so this is a really nice instrument. This is by far my favourite ukulele out of all that we've owned yeah. in the last if year. If we had to give away this one, we absolutely wouldn't be giving it away because Kevin would cry like a little <laughs> um, baby. I said I'm never giving this one away, I'm never selling this one, and I don't think I will. Um, because it was the first really nice one I bought, and I just love it. It's the one that I play all the time. It's the one I always go and pick up. Um, so this one's going nowhere, but you are having a brand new one. A brand one. new one. I'm going to hold it now. Yeah. While we I, tell I, the I good don't people. I like it when you do that. Why are you so high and I'm so low? Because you're smaller than me. So what are the good people of the world? Because this is not just a UK wide. We will ship it worldwide, which sounds crazy, mm. doesn't it? Should we test Bongo Boy out? Shall we? Should we give him a test? Okay. So uh, Bongo Boy, let's go to close up Abby Cam. <laughs> it's failed. Oh. No. <laughs> We've got new cameras. You know, we love a new system, don't we? I, mean, me I don't know and, if I like that close up, Bongo Me Boy. and Bongo Boy have only spent two days <laughs> trying to make them all work properly, and this is our first video. Can we go back to full screen? Yeah, I don't like that close up, I'll be honest. Okay, Bongo full Boy. screen, Bongo Boy. So, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Surely we want to see a little bit behind the scenes. Can we see Bongo Boy? Oh, can we? Let's here he break comes. the third wall. Oh, there he is. is. The third wall or the fourth wall? <laughs> I don't know, but how cool does our behind the scenes look like? It does look cool. We see our auto cue, our cameras. Bongo Boy sat behind his drum kit, or in front of his drum kit. Yeah. All right, okay, right, that's enough of that. Let's, yeah, let's yeah. get us back. Let's get us back. So, you want to get your hands on this bad boy. This competition... What do you have to do? Well, this competition is running for the entirety of February and March, because it's such a big competition, we couldn't possibly give away more yeah. than this. Give it two weeks and Kevin will start throwing things in, but initially, Probably. all we are giving away for the next two months is this bad boy. Okay, so, can, we, can we just stop there for a second? That's not true. What did we do on our live stream on Friday? We've added in prizes to this oh, already. Oh, see? I thought... However... I had deja vu, but she, no, it did actually she happen. She doesn't know what she's doing. It did actually happen. So there's more prizes in this competition. It runs for February and March. Um, we've added in, I believe, a £100 prize. Sorry, Mystery, yes, we've mystery played prizes. A, game. a £100 prize. Two a, £1? Two £1 prizes, a £20 prize, and I think a £15 prize. I think. I think that's what it was. So there's mystery prizes. So even if you don't win this... You could win... You might win... A mystery. A mystery, mystery prize. Mystery. At least one of which will be a mystery <laughs> ukulele. Let's hope it's not the pound, what a, eh? What a competition. What a competition. What so a competition. to enter, all you have to do is... What do you have to do? You have to be subscribed to our channel and you have to comment on any of our videos. I got... Uke babe. Oh yeah. Yes, I you got do. Uke babe. See what I did there. So that is all you have to do. If you mm. don't have your subscription settings set to show that you're subscribed, you do also need to just pop in brackets afterwards that you are subscribed. Yeah. Thank you. Um, very but we much. will check when you win. We will yeah, kind of we like will ask go, for yeah, a screenshot show us, to show that you're subscribed. Show us your subscription, just because you know we don't want to give it to people that lie. <laughs> No liars here. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. So just to recap, you must be subscribed and you can comment on any of our videos saying, I got uke, babe. Do you know what? Comment everywhere. I mean, it won't enter you into the competition, but put it out there in the streets. Yeah, you can comment anywhere. I got uke, babe. That allows on you to search for it. Yeah, on YouTube. Please don't... You can comment on our social media, but it won't enter you into the competition. No. <laughs> um, yeah, so what a prize. What a prize. Um, or we set are, of prizes, We are even. drawing it on the last Friday of March. We which are. Which is going the to be 31st. our later in the day live stream, our 8pm live stream. And we have... Oh, I'm so sorry, my... My timer's going off to test my blood sugar. And we, have, we have a room full of diabetics. <laughs> Should we just start a diabetes channel? Should we? Because you two already have it, great. and I'm clearly on my way. So. <laughs> <laughs> we just start it. Um, so, 31st of March. Join us, 8pm, 
UK standard time. Who do we have as a guest on the 31st of March? We have got the amazing Four String Boy. He will be joining us live via the modern wonder of technology yeah. because Sammy he's in Denmark. I have offered to go to Denmark. No plane tickets seem to have materialised yet. Not quite yet, but you know, you never know. You never know. Um, so, yeah. Live on the 31st of March, we're going to do the draw. I'm sure we'll do something magical to do the draw. Mm. I mean, we might not throw darts this time. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll do it live from a bowling alley. Why don't we get a famous Martin in to draw <laughs> the winner? Do you know any famous Martins? I have to check my phone book. Well, I think that rolls on quite nicely into Sam's quiz, doesn't should we have, it? Should we have a little quiz? Should we have a quiz? A little Martin. Right, make it quick, Bongo Boy. Right. There's a quiz. I can have my own theme music. Mm -mm. Getting delusions of grandeur. Yeah, we like haven't, we haven't set him up on the camera, actually, have we? I can set myself up on the behind-the-scenes okay. camera. Okay, yeah, okay, go on. Then. That's enough, I think. That's enough for today. Uh, right. I have a quiz for you guys. And it has a theme okay. that you might pick up on. Okay. Cool. Do you want to? So, who delivered the iconic I Have a Dream speech? Buzz! Martin Luther King. Junior. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, I'm more looking at the cameras, uh, Sam's use of the cameras, and I'm like, Sam, why are you using just that camera? Just go back to the main camera. Because I thought it'd be fun to have like a, woo. <laughs> oh, you'd be making but people it, dizzy. It'll go really bright. Okay, yeah. I'll do the other one. Right. Who is the lead singer of Coldplay? Buzz. Chris Martin. It is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Which actor played Bilbo Baggins? Buzz Martin Freeman. Correct. Uh, I don't know what the I don't can't get the theme of this. No, I don't prison. know what it is. Okay, who what is the name of the bassist in Spandau Ballet? Oh! Buzz! You said oh <laughs> Martin Kemp. Correct. Are you keeping tally? Have you got I'm, three? I'm winning. I win every quiz, remember? Do you not remember the memo? <laughs> Kevin must win every quiz. <laughs> Uh, right, two more questions. Which Puerto Rican singer wrote Living La Vida Loca? Beep. Oh! Buzz. Buzz. I didn't beep, but I beep. Buzz. Go on. Ricky Martin. Yeah. He likes to be called Dicky. I saw him live in Evita in New York. He was phenomenal. <laughs> right, last great. question. All right. Uh, Tiebreaker, worth 10 points. Oh. Who is the author of Game of Thrones? Buzz! Oh. George R. Martin. George R.R. R. R. Martin. Martin. <laughs> but cool. yes, congratulations. Right. High five, Abby. Abby won the quiz. Abby wins the no, Martin. No, 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 no. So, um, Martin quiz, February and March is extra prizes. Martin quiz. Martin quiz. Martin quiz. Martin, quiz. Martin, Martin competition. competition. Martin competition. Oh, that was a Martin quiz. That was a Martin mm. quiz. So, yeah, please don't forget, if you want to win this beautiful uh, Martin T1 Streetmaster tenor ukulele, all you have to do is be subscribed to our channel and on any one of our videos, comment, I got uke, babe. Awesome. Good luck. And be subscribed. I said that. Did you? Yeah. I don't listen to you anymore. Thanks for joining us. It's great to see you, not you so much. <laughs> wow. And please, please, please don't forget, as always, to Kevin. Like. Subscribe. He's very slow. It's not even, you can't even see it on the camera. He's very slow. I just want you to say ring the bell. You've got to say ring the bell. Hang on, I need to unmute oh. myself. Ring the bell. That was flawless. Flawless. Bye Absolutely for now. Absolutely flawless. We'll get better at this one, though. <laughs>